Hello and welcome to my channel, Treasure Hunter and DIY, buying to resell and hopefully making a profit. So let's go and see what I bought. Please don't forget to subscribe, like and share. Thank you. Hey guys, oh, I promised to you, I said it, we're gonna have uh, other items uh, from Wedgwood and we can talk a little bit about Wedgwood. Uh, so let's get see what I was talking about. The before, a uh, couple of days ago, weeks ago, we talked about the black Wedgwood uh, ring. And I said it, the light blue uh, doesn't work that much like the black. Now, you guys, uh, here is a couple of uh, jewelry what I own and what is on sale and what, what is mine. So, I want a couple of other items with the ways I'm going to talk about it because that's a different story what happened. Um, let's go start with the necklace. So this necklace is come with the original uh, box. Well, be completely honest with you, this is this one was coming with the original box, box and leaflet. Yeah, uh, this is the one. This is not gold. Before everybody thinking, this is not gold, this is gold plated. Wedgwood done gold uh, jewelry, sterling silver jewelry, and gold plated jewelry. This is one of the gold plated jewelry. Now this, uh, I won on the auction with the original box and leaflet for 20 quid. In the same time, I was won this one on auction. This is uh, sterling silver, depend on the necklace. So when it's arrived, what was in my neck and I asked my fiance which one I should be keep. And he said it, I should keep this one because this is, he think is more nicer. So I keep this one, so this is mine. Before you guys searching on eBay, is not that. This half Wedgwood made in England. This is a new piece, newer piece. It's not antique, it's not vintage, it's a newer piece. piece. Somebody bought it for 59 pound, but uh, some reason decided to sell it for 20 pound and I bought it. This is a little cherub, baby cherub, kid cherub. I'm not really sure. It's a cherub, but absolutely stunning piece. So this is mine. I keep this one. This is a light blue one. I want another one, necklace like this, but dark blue pendant, but I already sold it. But I will make a video about what I sold already, and you guys gonna see a couple of items what I bought, is arrived, put it up on eBay, and straight away I sold it. So, uh, some of the items what I gonna show on that video, you guys never saw it. So this is a sterling silver pendant and necklace is have the same thing Wedgwood made in England have the double V 
obviously four wedge wood and 74 what means it's coming from when you have a, a number on it like 72 62 82 that means it's from that here so this is from 1972 absolutely stunning necklace absolutely love it but because I keep this one I sell in this one this is in my eBay shop um, selling I think so $24.99 yeah I think so uh, how I said it light blue doesn't work that much as a uh, dark blue uh, or green or black pink purple well not purple lilac so um, I'm selling for $24.99 and is in auction as well for $19.99 so if you guys like to have it, you can find it in the Treasure Hunter 83 eBay shop. Now, I have two rings. Boat ring, boat ring is the same. The same camo picture on it. Same uh, look, but different age. This one is coming from 1972. This one is coming from 1970. So two years older, this piece than that piece. Well, how I know this just have on the ring inside sterling silver. As can see it or not focus no not focus the same sterling silver and was coming with the original wedgewood box but again actually it's coming with the black one but because I keep it the black one I selling with the blue one because with when is something coming with the original box and lay flat is worth always more than if you are just selling the actual item so i selling this ring for 38 pound because it's like 40 uh the lowest price so i go in always under people kind of uh, and I selling it for 38 now I had a problem with that I was sold it for 40 and then when it arrived the uh, buyer realized uh, this was on the right size so want to have return I just saying I do not do return but because it was on fit and there was 40 pound I said it all right you can return it when I receive the ring I gonna send the return money so that's how it was coming back so I was put it on eBay again to sell it this one I actually keeping it because I collecting at the moment I bidding for a green one how I said it so I hopefully I gonna win that so I can next time I can say all right guys I have a green one as well because right now I have a light blue one and a black uh, back to Wedgwood I bidding on green uh, ashtray um, the two was for 99p so I won for 99p is different a picture on it this is the other one you see it's different 
the color on it absolutely stunning I love their work this is a green color so when I bidding for stuff and because I collect in Redwood I always trying to bidding when it's coming in too because one I can keep the other one I can sell now one I keeping for my collection this one this obviously having in the back again the Wedgwood made, made in England and 69 means it's 1969 so I, I keep this one and this one um, focus 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 is saying Wedgwood made in England but unfortunately this doesn't have any number on it so that means this is an older piece uh, a younger piece so I keep the 69 one and I selling the newest piece this one uh, I put it up for two ninety nine. I said it I bought it for ninety nine p the two. So two ninety nine and plus postage. Uh, you can find it on my eBay shop, Treasure Hunter eighty three. Absolutely stunning. I keep that one. And I sell in this one. I said it on my eBay shop. This is have a little chip on the edge. So. When you're looking at it on eBay, uh, on the description, i saying about the chips because I like to be honest. Why are selling so cheap? Now, let's go talk about these vases. I won it on auction for £3. I was really want to have a, a vase like this shape because one vase is selling on eBay for ten pound. So for having the boat for three pound plus postage is a really good price. Now I want it and it's arrived in pieces. You can see that was in pieces. Both sides see so I sent it a message for the seller obviously was really nice and uh, offered to me full refund and keep the pieces um, so I did this one is have GS and 72 made in England, Redwood. This is from 1972. Little cherubs around. Look at how cute they are. Absolutely love them. I love I love the veg woodwork. Doesn't matter it doesn't hold any more than much wallow the veg wood items, but I love them. Absolutely beautiful work. Look at them. So I kept this one obviously for my collection and I felt so sorry to throw in away this one as a piece of history. This is from made in England and uh, have G G something. Obviously, there is the wedge wood and there is the number 63. So, what means 
is, is this is from 1963 uh, older piece than this one so I felt sorry to throw in away so we bought super glue and my fiance is super glue it for me together obviously a little piece is, is missing and you can see it's been broken but I felt so sorry throwing away a piece of history I was so upset even I got back my my money I still felt upset about it because this is from 1963 my mom was three years old when they made this one very old please piece and an absolutely amazing job and then it's been broken I was so upset about it you can see guys how beautiful is it so anyways back to the pieces I have blue I have green I still missing a couple other uh, colors what I gonna um, obviously collecting in the time um, I like to have a pink one, like to have a lilac one, like to have a yellow one I like to have a black one, a dark blue one so slowly I will collecting all the colors because I do not collecting by pictures somebody doing like that way I collecting by colors and believe me I'm not gonna use it as a ashtray I will feel so sorry to finish up a, a, a cigarette on this beautiful artwork and no way absolutely love it beautiful artwork so this is the history about their two ways unfortunately I felt so upset when I received it in pieces I fixed it well my fiance fixed it for me and very carefully moving it around because poor little thing is in peace absolutely stunning stunning work it wasn't being cleaned yet this they are new but all the jewelry being cleaned I always do clean them I said it this one and this one exactly the same just this one from 1972 and this is from 1970 uh, this knock lens is mine um, I ordered the uh, 925 silver knock lens for this one so I can wear it and this one I sell in it on auction 1999 or buy it now 24.99 treasure hunter 83 you can find them my shop on ebay um free to ask offer uh, i will consider it uh, the offer and uh, if it's worth it um, because i have to look at like i have to pay uh, ebay fees people fees uh, I actually buying these things and not getting it for free so I have to look at uh, so many uh, things when I selling items sometimes I going under it how much I bought it I just selling it to get rid of it because new items coming in invest uh, uh, new item coming in uh, hopefully next time when I gonna see you guys I gonna show you some Murano absolutely beautiful pieces what I bought uh, awaiting for delivery so I can't wait to show you guys that I won uh, a green uh, pendant necklace 925 sterling silver one 
and hopefully I'm gonna win the sterling silver grain uh, rings so I can show you guys my collection I try to always upload in videos sometimes I am too busy with my shop and with doctors obviously because I'm sick but please stay with me and as uh, soon as I can I upload in all this new video please take care of have a good day thank you for watching you can find my eBay shop treasure hunter 83 thank you for watching bye love you guys thank you for watching please don't forget subscribe like and share my video thank you